सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई विल टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट न्यू स्टाइल ऑफ टेक्स्ट पार्टिकल एनिमेशन विद यूजिंग ईवी रेंडर गाइस इट्स रियली सिंपल एंड बेस्ट ट्यूटोरियल फॉर बिगिनर्स सो गाइस नाउ आई टीच यू हाउ आई क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ ब्यूटीफुल पार्टिकल एनिमेशन First of all, guys, click on here and select all and press delete key. So now, guys, I'm going to take a text tool. This one, text, and guys, press tab, guys, edit mode, and type your letter like a blender, like this. So guys, select and go to on here. That's my text property, guys. See that's my paragraph to change center. Yeah, and guys, now I change font. font i like bold and thick font so guys go to down and i like this one yes that's good so guys open yeah okay so guys rotate rotate 90 degree and next one guys i create extrude so go to on here geometry and see guys that's my extrude increase increase like this simple like a 0.07 right okay so guys go to on here and wireframe check guys i change resolution this one i like 10 is good yes right okay so guys all is good that's my simple text and next one guys i have plus segments actually subdivision surface so guys select and go to on object and guys see that's my convert to mesh check Okay, so now guys, go to on edit mode and select all and right click use subdivision surface and guys subdivision number I like five is good simple right? Okay, see guys that's my simple text and now guys this time I apply science friction material so go to on here that's my blender kit add on so guys use science friction type enter see guys that's my different different style of materials. But guys, I like this one. So drag and drop. Yeah. So guys, click on here. Yes. See guys, that's my simple material, and it's looking really cool, right? Okay. So now, guys, go to on here, render. Okay. So guys, now I change render setting. EV is good. Ambient occlusion check, bloom power check, and screen spacing check. Yes. See guys, that's really good. Science friction text. Okay, so now, guys, this time, I take this time, guys, use icosphere. This one, yeah, and change radius like a zero point two is good. Enter, and guys, go to on here. Okay, out of frame, like this, and guys, I apply material. So guys, create new material. Guys, I use simple. Emission material, this one emission, and color, guys. I use like a orange color. Yes, and strength, I like ten is good. Yes, and guys, click on here. Yeah, see, guys, that's my text material, and second one, guys, that's my sphere material. Okay, so now, guys, my material is good, and next one, guys, I create particle animation. So, guys, click on here, and guys, select. See guys, that's my particle. So guys, click on here and create particle. So click on plus point. Yeah. See guys, that's my particle. And next one, guys, I increase number. And guys, increase number like a ten thousand. Guys, see that's my end, and I like zero. Yes. See guys, that's my particle. And guys, see that's my lifetime. I like five hundred. Yes. And source. Guys, see distribution. I like random, like this. And guys, see that's my velocity. Velocity, I like zero. Yeah. 
and see guys that's my render right and i see it that's my render as so use object and i see that's my object to take icosphere like this see guys that's my effect and guys go to on viewport yes it's good see guys that's my particles right okay so now guys you can also change this particle size see guys that's my scale size you can take like a 0 0.04 and guys scale random like a 0 0.2 yes right see guys that's my simple particles okay so guys now and guys play guys change guys i change gravity it's not correct so guys go to back and guys go to on force fill width and gravity are like zero yes and guys go to back and play okay but guys see that's not correct so gravity is good and go to on up guys velocity is good yes so guys now go to on down and see guys that's my viewport display and yeah that's my particles right it's really good guys you can increase particle count is dependent on your work see guys that's my number you can apply like a increase particles yeah right okay so guys i decrease number like a one that's my only tutorial part and guys now go to back and play guys see that's not gravity effect okay so guys next one i apply turbulence effect so guys go to on add and use force field and use trouble this one yes and guys go to back and play yeah okay so guys stop and guys again select this turbulence and see guys that's my strength i like two so guys one more time go to back and play yes see guys that's my particle and now guys select this text and particle i see that's my viewport display check yeah okay so guys again one more time go to back and play yes see guys that's a beautiful particle effect right it's really simple and guys i show you my render to view see guys that's my render and go to back and play yes really good okay so guys now you can also create different style of pattern particle animation pattern so guys now i apply fall off so guys go to on here click on this one and i select this turbulence and guys see that's my fall off and maximum distance check and guys maximum i like one yes and guys go to on here like a location change like a zero point actually 2.8 and guys see that's my animation actually guys now i increase frame like 500 is good for me and guys location check on zero frame now guys i go to like a 300 frames and location change like minus 2.8 enter and press animation key yes okay see guys that's my different style of particle animation yes okay it's good okay so guys select this turbulence and now guys see that's my global and global check and one more time guys go to back and play yeah much better see guys that's my really cool particle so guys click on here and guys go to back and play yes see guys that's my really cool and beautiful particle effect right it's really simple guys okay so now guys my particle animation it's really good and guys i take camera and camera check guys set your camera angle so guys 90 0 and 0 and guys location change is dependent on your work like this and go to back yes okay so guys closer and guys go to back and play yes see guys that's my really cool particle effect okay so now guys finally 
go to a text and guys particle I increase number like a five fifty thousand enter guys take little bit time for render and see guys that's my heavy particle effect it's really good okay so guys my final effect is finished and guys yeah okay so guys stop and guys go to on here and use 30 fps and guys 50 frame rate 500 go to on output guys create new folder like this and take any file name and guys go to on here and take file name and press accept check yes okay so now guys go to on here color and use black color like this yeah much better guys you can also apply simple area light so guys use area light and go to on up guys i increase size like two simple and power 100 is good yes okay so guys go to camera and final render preview yes much better see guys that's my final render it's looking really good and my stylish text and guys also i apply one more light for front one and guys go to on here and rotate like this guys same 90 and align on text yes right and guys go to camera and one more time render preview so click on final render viewport shading yes guys i change this area light power like a 30 actually 10 yes yes good okay so guys increase like 15 is good yes okay see guys that's my final one it's looking really good and guys go to back and play yes okay so guys that's it my final animation is finished that's my beautiful particle animation so guys that's it if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you